almost look like Valentino, but they are by the brand Soda. $21. We are Ross now, guys. This was next to Ross. There's another one. This one is 19. Hmm. Cool. Uh, dough. Those are all teeny sizes. <laughs> Why don't they have those shoes in my size? <laughs> this is super cute, but I like the Valentino color better. The nuts. Excuse me. Thank you. Size Let's see how they fit. This is super cute. I just love the color. I think it'll go well with the skirt. The skirt I got. So we shall see. Let's see. Fuchsia. Ooh, this I really like. Who's this? Can I call? Twenty-four. I think it might be too big. This is suede. The heels are perfect. Let's see how this looks. Oh man, I want to show you. Oh my god, just a little too big. Oh my god, little bees. How cute are they? I still need to try the other ones. I can never find this in a smaller size. Hello guys, welcome, welcome, welcome to Fabulous Jet channel. If you don't know who this is, I'm Jackie, aka Fabulous Jet. We have two channels. We have Fabulous Jet and we have Fabulous Jet 2 live sale. One is for my shenanigans, which is where I am. And the other is business. Okay? So if you're new here, welcome and please subscribe on both channels. It's free, free, free. Show your girl some love. Okay. All right, guys. I got to turn the light on. It's a little dark in here. Let's turn on the lights. Better not flicker again like it did the last time. But anyway, guys. So what we're doing today. Let's put this a little bit further away. So, yeah. What we're doing today is affordable shopping for fall okay it's not thrifting it's just shopping for less or dress for less so if you hear the logo dress for less what does that mean it means i went to ross <laughs> so you guys if you don't know in the first in the beginning of a season stores like ross dds which are brothers and sisters overload themselves with pieces from some designer pieces especially ross and some brand names and then some early showroom but they are affordable so we can look fabulous without really breaking the bank okay i'm not i buy those those kind of clothes like away around town these are some of these pieces especially pieces that i get from dds which i will show you a few pieces 
those items I don't use to go to a party or whatever, but those are my run around, you know, going, going grocery shopping, going shopping period, or meeting a couple of friends, you know, for, for whatever, whatever, or even just hanging out with the family. I'm not going to go pull out a designer piece, you know, just to run to, to Sprouts or Ralph's or smart and final or full for less we ain't doing all that or thrifting yeah i'm not gonna pull out my expensive clothing to go thrifting but so i figured this is for what i really want to show you i got from us was mostly shoes this is the time guys if you're looking for affordable shoes fashion forward mostly from la showroom some from california matt this is the time to go to these places, Didi's and Ross. Ross gets most of their stuff from California Mats, which is brand name items, and a few LA showroom. But Didi's gets most of their stuff from LA showroom. So if I was to go downtown to being that I have a, um, a wholesale seller's permit, because you can buy those things at the showroom without a seller's permit. I can, if I go downtown, I will have to buy in bulk from the showrooms, which means I'll have to buy six pieces, blah, 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 blah. But they won't charge me tax, which is okay, because I pay the tax at the end of the year. But now if I go to Ross, or actually go to Didi's, the same wholesale prices are being sold at Didi's without me buying it in bulk, okay? We don't have to. I don't have to buy six. I don't have to buy 12. I just buy the pieces that I like. So that's the plus about going to Didi's. Ross is the same thing. You go to California Mart, you have to have a license. But um, I think on Saturdays it's free to the public. But, you know, you don't have a limitation as to what to buy. All right. In case you didn't know, this is what I'm all about. I'm fabulous yet, only because I'm fabulous without breaking the bank okay i am not here to break the bank i'm trying to show you guys how we can do affordable dressing we got ross Didi's, bollington tj max marshalls that's what we're working with and then we have the fast fashion zara h&m uh forever 21 or what else? i don't shop at forever 21 so i don't even know why i mentioned that all right so ross we are going to begin with the rust shopping, all right, all the shoes fell out. Like, first of all, this cargo pants I have on, I did get this from Ross, super cute, super cute. This was $18. Yeah, I had to take off the tag because I had to put it on. And this is what it looks like Angel's Kiss, super cute. That's the back, and that's the front. You know, she got um, tennis shoes, but your girl, I think that I don't do tennis shoes as much. I have on my Zara, my Zara flats. That's what I have on. Yeah. And this little top is actually a dress, but I got this from Didi's for like $7. And uh, look at the flowers. Do you all see that? You can literally feel it's meshy but you can feel the flowers it's not just stamped it's interwoven inside of it you know it's like a double so yeah it's a dress guys knowing that i would never wear it as a dress because it's very transparent so i've just tucked it in and decided i was going to wear it as you know as a blouse all right Let's move back over here. Okay, so, all right. So we get that out of the way. I was able, even though as I'm doing shoes, but I could show you a couple. Well, yeah, let's do, let's do the shoes. The first, when I walked in, which I'm gonna show you a little video, I got this beautiful, shoe is a dupe of i think valentino only because i mean 
it's not quite the same i can show you my valentinos but this is a dupe this is by soda and the only reason i picked this up because of the color so rich beautiful look at that so i will and this was only 21 21.99 i am going to try it on so you guys get to see what it looks like i think i should try it on when i'm done because i don't want to keep getting up taking up shoes i ain't got that energy hey the next one is another fuchsia i went fuchsia crazy we see this this is by kenneth cole so this was um, $24.99. See the heel is suede, beautiful, chunky, size eight and a half. It's a little big on me, but I'm going to put a pad in here because I love it. So this is patent leather. This is fuchsia. This is more like, um, this is suede. I won't call this fuchsia. Some kind of plumish color, I would say still in the pink category so i got those and then i mean i just pick a few pieces they had so much shoes you guys will see it oh there's another shoe hold on if i show you the boots hold on guys this is another one I was trying this one and I forgot. This is a sling bag, but it's a penny loafer. See right here, penny loafer, patent leather. And then we come back here, we have the chunky heel and we have the sling bag. And this is by Soda, which is part of early showroom group of, if you go get your shoes, let's say you go to Joao, the wholesale place, they will make you buy 12 of these. You just can buy a piece. That's why sometimes it's good to go to these discount stores, i.e. Ross and Didi's. And this was only $21. Super cute. Got that. Now, the next one is a brand. It's a pair of boots. And this is by Kenzie. Okay, if you're familiar with Kenzie, this is their boots. Do we see this? Super cute. Love it. And I was shocked. This can see was only, I took off the tag because I was trying it on. But you can see on the back of it where it says $20. Yes, it was $19.99 for Kinsey. Now, if you were to go to Macy's, this will cost you $99. Okay, it has a little stretch kind of socks thing going on right there. I love the lace. It has a little bit of black. Guys, you know, fall is when we... I'm so excited for fall. Ask me where I'm going. I don't know. I mean, I want to travel, but I haven't decided where I want to go. Either my sisters are coming from London or I am going over there. We have not decided what we're going to do. So... We are late procrastinators. The ticket is going to cost us an arm and a leg if we don't make a decision. But anyway, I did get that. I can't see what's 19. Another Ross. This is another brand. If I can find a mate to it, we'll be good. Where are you mates? Okay. This is a cowboy boots. It's like, I don't want to even call it a cowboy. It's half cowboy and half stilettos. Okay, you see that? It gives you the cowboy boots vibes up here and a little pointy. And then when you come here, you get sexiness. Okay, you got a flat heel. It's um, it's um, embossed croc. And this is by Chinese Laundry. see that Chinese laundry and these two where the price at 
she took out the price okay anyway it was 32 dollars. you can see where it's marked 33 that's what happens when they market oh here's the kenzie here's a price for the kenzie boots 19 i just saw that in the bag so you know those things are stapled and here's the one for here we go for this chinese laundry 32 $32.99. Super cute. Can't wait to try it on. So we got those. Okay. Now, let me show you. Let me show you the other boots I got. So being that Ross and Dee Dee's are sisters, might as well just combine this. Um, should I? Or should I do a different Dee Dee's haul? No, I'm just gonna do it. Yeah, so I went to Dee Dee's, Dee Dee's bag, the same company, just like TJ Maxx and Marshalls, as sisters and home goods. Those are sister, brother, cousin or whatever. Ross and Didi's are sisters. Ross is the biggest sister. Didi's is the little sister. Okay. So I went to Didi's and I get the, I got this Charles David boots. Another brand. brand. Charles David, guys. I think this is my third Charles David boots. I just love the way. Okay, the tag is cut off, but you can see where it says Charles. And then on the inside, if you look at it closely, it's David. Oh, here we go. It says Charles right here. David is white. Ask me how I'm going to style this. I'm going to have to be creative because I'm not a, a white kind of girl, but I could not pass this voice. And this Charles David boots were only $16.99. Once more, you go to Macy's. I'm going to keep using Macy's as a reference point only because a lot of people go to Macy's. Not a lot of people go to Nordstrom. So you go to Nordstrom's rack, you'll find a Charles David and it'll probably cost you on sale maybe $69.79. But Didi's $16. Come on now. Super cute. So and that's from the little sister of Ross, which is Didi's. So. I think those are all the shoes I got. Now, let me show you my little outer jackets. Uh oh, what the hell? From Ross. It's not even a jacket, it's a puffer vest with a drawstring. You guys will see me try it on. Especially, I think I only tried the green one. But right, this is super cute. I love this brand. This was only $13.99 and this is a new look. So they're all different brands. Hmm. One and the same. So this is a new look. Let's put it on. Let's stand up. And right now that we're doing clothing. I have so much stuff on the floor. Looks good with the cargo pants. Super, super cute. So I'm tall, guys. I cannot try to make this any shorter than, you know, I know some people can fit a frame easily. But I'm a tall girl, so I have to bend my camera. So, yes. Super cute. All right, so we did get that in the black. You guys, if I... If I... Um, oh, Sherry's on. I'm missing my Sherry. So I got the blue one. That black one is super heavy. And that was $13.99. And then this is $12.99. And this is by the brand Orange Kiss. Orange case essential. 
a dollar less than the black one. This is the blue. Yes, we just, you know, dressing for less. This. We're not putting that much, you know, effort to try to look cute. We're not doing that. It's just simple, easy, breezy. Go to Ross, find these pieces, put them together, step out of the house, and you look like you spent a lot of money. We're not doing, we're not like, oh my God, I have to put this together. I have to put that together. We're not doing all that. This is just plain simple. So we got that. I am going to try them on with the boots so you guys get to see. Actually, not really. Now, this is my best one. This is Orange Kiss, $12.99. So, you guys know they have like a, a drawstring. So, in California, vests are really more appropriate than jackets because, you know, you can make it a bomber by pulling the string. Because it's really not that cold in Cali. Cargo pants. Here we go. Maybe a nice cross body. I pull the, the string. You can either make it cinch or you can just let it go. I love the green. The green is my favorite. With my cargo pants. They did have a green cargo pants. Oh, this is way too much. So... I think I pulled it too much. Okay. If you don't want to pull it too much, that's it. And you can zip it up. Which I got to be extremely cold. Being that I wear a lot of scarves, I will never zip up. But it's nice to zip up. It is. It looks gorgeous. Yes. Super cute. This one was $12.99. now what i got uh, another puffer this one i got from Didi's. i cannot resist haha <laughs> do we see this if you have a ross or Didi's close to you check it out but not all Didi's are created equal because when i went to when i bought this by the Didi's by my house this beautiful chocolate brown heavy duty puffer is by Sisono Outerwear Collection. This was $16.99. And I went to the other DVDs close to the Ross that I went. They did not even have this. So just check it. Check, check your DVDs, check your Ross. See who has what. They might not have it, but they might have something similar. All right, so here we are. Another puffer. Can you imagine how cute this is imagine we have this part where you you push it and then pull the string if you want to make it a little puffer a little tighter same thing here you have to squeeze and then pull out if my nails will permit me to do so which i am gonna do my nails today guys today no today is shipping day so i'll do my nails tomorrow i don't have the energy to do both all right i'm trying to pull guys my nails away okay so you can make it and pull it a little make it shorter and puff this looks like something kim kardashian will wear but this only came out did this for $16.99 beautiful I have to see the brand I don't even think I told you guys the, the brand the brand how cute is this ha. yes super cute running out the house this bag is right here so I'm just going to use it it's not that this is what I will carry but, mm. no, no pockets, but it's all good. No pockets, huh? No pockets. Why? All right. Oh, I did tell you all the brand. This is by 
seasonal collection. All right. Super, super cute. This one came out of Diddy's. I'll tell you, don't sleep on Diddy's, people. Diddy's discount. It has a name here. Full leather outerwear. Yeah, it's full leather. Not everything you have got to be leather, especially your puffers. How is a puffer going to become leather? It's like, make it make sense. So, yeah, we got that. It's an outerwear day. This too is from Diddy's. But this is, believe you me, it's Fashion Nova. Fashion Nova, straight out of Diddy's. That's why I say sometimes you just got to shop at these stores. I was extra large. It's the only one they had. And um, this Fashion Nova is, uh, what the hell, where's the purse? Okay, let me look in the back. Oh, here we go. It fell off. Extra large, $12.99 for Fashion Nova. Motorcycle jacket. And we know Fashion Nova is not going to be leather. It's another full leather bag. Jeez, can you see that? Super cute. Super, super cute. Yes. Fashion Nova motorcycle jacket. I love the color, guys. The color is what gets me. If it was black, I don't even know if I would have picked it up. But for that price, okay, let me not tell a story. I would have. So. Here we are. Who's going to be? Oh, I'm not about to jump on a bike. So, when I wear this, I won't be doing all this. But I'm just trying to show you guys how it looks for you all bike, biker chicks out there. Yes. Super cute. Nova. All I need is my helmets. Oh, <laughs> Alright, so this is only twelve ninety nine. Came straight out. It's Fashion Nova that came straight out of Diddy's. And this is how I will wear mine. Just simple, easy breezy. Yeah. Okay. So that's that. So Diddy's. Another DDs. Another DDs. I have to show you all the bags so you know you're going to tell it no story. Another Fashion Nova. This one black label. Another extra large. Still have the tag. Fashion Nova. But we didn't go to Fashion Nova now, did we? We went to DDs. And voila. This one was $15.99. $15.99. Extra large. Another faux leather. But the good thing about faux leather is if it's raining out there, you don't need to pull out your leather jacket. You can just wear your faux leather and run out in the rain, come back home and just shake it off or wipe it off and you're good to go. No damage there. Now, if you're wearing 100% genuine leather, okay, you're not seeing that. If we're wearing, a, if we're wearing 100% genuine leather, then we'll be like, oh my God, my leather, my leather. It's gonna have watermarks. But not, not with full leather. Super cute. Here we are. Oh, Leslie is on show you today. All right, I'm missing it. I'm gonna rewatch it. I'm gonna stream it. All right, here we go. Super cute. Fashion Nova. I love the color. You see that? Yeah, this will look good with some boots on. So, yeah, let me try it on with those boots. Maybe the um, Chinese laundry. Just kill two beds at once. Down. Okay. So 
but we're gonna try it on with this Chinese one. Chinese laundry, here we come. Now, this Chinese laundry, I took a seven and a half. I thought it was gonna be tight, but no, it was just perfect. All right, so here we are. Let's turn the camera this way. Maybe that will help us out. Super cute. Yes. So I still got the cargo pants with the boots. I mean, which you can't get to see it, but if I was to wear a dress, voila, you can see the boots totally. Like who's sitting at the door? Who's at the door? Mr. Simba. Simba, Simba. So here we are with the boots. Super cute. With the Fashion Nova jacket. Okay. All right. So that was that. Let's move on to the next. Get another pair. I forgot another pair of boots. This is from Diddy's. I got this one. I, the only reason I got this is to because of the heel. This is an early showroom brand, and this is by by Glaze. All right, there is the full suede. I think I won't say this is suede, but. It feels like suede. And this was $13.99. I don't know what I did with the uh, scissors. So, let's try. Oh, here we go. Trying to cut the, cut the, cut this little tag thing they got going let's try this on and see how this looks okay i'm gonna share with my video i don't want to know whatever people coming for me these big companies will try to take away little youtubers money if you show their content it had happened to me is it i am i am whatever company i was doing a video one day and now uh, nick canyon was on and i didn't even realize it on my tv and i turned around boom copyright i said from who sure i'm like with this big ass company you're trying to take my little two dollars you're greedy so now i'm gonna try to be when it comes to the talk shows or whatever, whatever, try to be trying to hide them. I don't want to turn off my TV on only because I need the light. My room, my room can be really dark because I have a lot of gray going on. I don't like bright, white, all that stuff. I'm like, who who sleeps with a white comforter? I'll be washing it every other day. So, but anywho, I'm trying on those uh, glaze boots. So you can see how this looks. So yes, there they are. Look at the heel. Beautiful. Mm -hmm. Oh, you know, it would look good with one of the puffers. I just put this. Let me see that. How cute is 
this. Voila. Super cute. Now, those boots were only $13.99. This is an LA showroom brand. I know some people say, oh, I designed the shoes. Yeah, but sometimes you got to get the affordable shoes so you can run around. You cannot just say you're going to wear designer shoes all the time to go grocery shopping or whatever. Especially me who don't like tennis shoes. I mean, it's not my thing. I didn't grow up with tennis shoes. Regular shoes is what I like. Tennis shoes, I feel like I'm a tomboy. I used to be one of those when I was a young girl, but I'm trying to be a lady. No tennis shoes for me. All right. The next thing I got is this cute little skirt by Jolie and Joy. My PJs, my nightgown I have is made by this company. Maybe that wasn't even supposed to be a nightgown. Maybe it was just supposed to be a dress. But anyway, this is $10.99. $10.99. I love the color. There was another shoe. At Ross, that will go so well with these boots because it was metallic. Open toe, I think I will get those. But this will look good with a men's blazer. So I took an extra large because I put it around my neck and I don't know. I'm gonna try that. Alright guys, here's the skirt. So I just decided to um to pair it up. It's an extra large. But I think I got this out of the juniors department. I'm still seeing freaking. And I paired it up with the soda shoes, the future, which most likely is not how I'm gonna wear it. But I just wanted to give you guys a look. So this is cute. So now the skirt is from Dee Dee's and the puffer is from Ross. And the skirt was, I don't know if I told you, $10.99 for the skirt and the puffer was $13. Okay, and the shoes was $21. Dress fabulous for less guys. We had to break a bank. What else you can actually lift up this arm? Um, by wearing maybe a, a men's jacket. I still have that, guys. If I tell you, <laughs> this is a dress. See that? But I can't. It's too sheer, so it's become a top. So, let me wear my men's Givenchy. Men's blazer with this. Voila. So either I do the shoe or I'll probably just do the Chinese laundry boots, which is something we can try, but I'm loving it with the men's blazer. Okay. It's missing a Givenchy button, but I'm going to have to sew that. It's only one button left, but it's supposed to be two. But it has everything else. Oh, that's missing too. But who cares? I think we thrifted this for like a dollar ninety-nine. Wrong. Super thrift. All right, let me try to put some boots on. Okay, so I do have it with the Chinese laundry. So please guys, I'm just trying to, I'm working a little corner only because I have so much stuff on the floor. You were like, her room is big. Why is she stuck in this corner? Stuff everywhere. That's why, so forgive me. If I show you, you'll be like, what Jackie, what is, I'm just throwing stuff any kind of way. See a pile down here? But yeah. So that's what. Let's move over here. So here we go. We have it with the boots. Voila. Chinese laundry. With this little Jolie skirt from LA Showroom. Joy and Jolie. Dress from. Z no, no. Mm. The skirt, yeah, LA showroom via DDs. And so this the dress was $6.99. $6. I'm going to show you the, the dress, okay? But 
is transparent. So I don't know if I want to show you. Well, let me just take this skirt off. Oh, here we are. Voila. What are the shoes I might have to, let me, instead of the boots, let's try on the, uh, the sling back. So now I have on the sling bag. Now that I cleaned up a little. So let's see. Yes. We do have the sling, chunky sling bag. Super cute. Love it, love it. Even with um let's try the motorcycle jacket with this. Just different, just pleather on pleather, why not? And then we got the patent leather sling back penny loafers by Soda. Should I really show them? All right, so my next thing I got was this cute houndstooth skirt by the brand Soho Apparel Group. And this is a medium. It comes in medium, large, extra large. And this was $10.99 from Didi's. So let's try this on. Super cute. Yeah, let's try it on. All right, so we have the Houndstooth little number skirt. I did pair this up with the um, Chinese laundry embossed mixed skin cowboy slash stiletto boots yeah so how cute is this this is so heavy this soho apparel they make very good brand it's a pull-on it's very heavy they do come if you go to this is from dd's guys they had different sizes so if you can find it in your part of town and you want me to get it for you, just haul out your girl. So I am going to style this still with my Givenchy men's blazer. And then I would probably do a puffer. But this is me dressing up. Okay. Take a little cheapy skirt from Didi's and a little $7 dress from Didi's and a $32 boots from Ross with a luxury thrifted men's blazer and you look like you spend a million dollars okay which we did because we look we know how to look fabulous by not breaking the bank it's that's what we do here you don't have to compete with the people who are buying a three thousand dollar bottega jacket wah, wah, wah. You can just go to Ross. If you have a fashion eye, that's all you need. Look at this. I can even put my Chanel belt over it to elevate it a little bit more. Or Givenchy belts, which I do have. Where are all my Givenchy belts? But now this is here because that's what I was wearing today. So we're just going to pretend. I have no Givenchy belts. I should wear that. Yeah, this is too skinny because it shows my little puffer. But guys, do you see what, I, what I'm talking about? Did we look like, I mean, minus the, the men's blazer, all this affordable shopping. Look at this. $6, $10, $21. Okay, DDs and Ross trying to tell you even though i did say that you can not wear these pieces to go out i can wear this to church i can wear this to go meet some friends so i have 
have my true religion bag that I carried yesterday. So I can wear that. Hold up. Any of you guys remember, I got this true religion bag from Didi's. I got the true religion um, glasses from Ross. So, this is how you can look fabulous without breaking the bag. Totally. I don't think you'll be see it very well. The window is reflecting. I did order some darker blinds because I'm tired of the brightness. Yes. So, this is this is how you look. This is how you 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 shop without breaking the bank. As my head is cut off, as I'm talking to you guys. One day I'll get this down pat. But that's me. If you don't like it, look away. So yes, guys, go to Ross, go to Didi's, thrift. Cause this jacket, I wouldn't say. I mean, I found some designer, some branding jackets at Didi's and Ross before, especially some Karl Lagerfelds. Most of my Karl Lagerfeld jackets are from Ross. So if I don't want to do the Givenchy, I could pull out a cow and just be all dressed up from Ross and did this which is what this video is all about okay yeah you see that i think this was only like uh eight dollars or nine dollars i had gotten and the bag i think was 27 i have a bigger black one it says true religion yeah, the bag was from Didi's. The glasses was from Ross. And I have another glasses that came out. Um, I think I got that from Burlington. Affordable shopping. Guys. What else can I... I didn't try on. Let me try on those uh, pinnacle shoes. You all didn't see that. put those shoes on they're little they're a little big but i'm praying that if i go to my other boss i can maybe find i'm gonna do a puffer with this it's another way of dressing it down it's like voila i still have that dress that looks like a blouse multifunctional you buy a dress when i was buying this dress I knew good and well I wasn't going to be able to wear it as a dress. I figured, you know, because of the fabric, I could wear it as a top. I'm not even going to cut it off. It's just, it would become a slip. It's going to do what it do. So, here's the shoe. A little chunky heel. It's a little tight. A little big, but it can still work. Yeah. Super cute. Super cute. Super cute. Very comfortable. The shoes are very comfy. Alright. Last but not the least is gonna be um the Kenzie boots. Which I am gonna go back and put my um my um cargo pants on because i want to try it on with this okay guys so before i put my cargo pants i thought i should show you guys this is a dress okay it's a dress it's my no but so it's like huh i gotta uh, do some squats so i can have a little bit of a little bit of booty i belong in the itsy bitsy teeny club but anyway but i ain't paying for nothing i'm happy with what god gave me so yeah so here's the dress i don't know i might wear it as a dress ah. 
I did say I was never gonna wear that dress, but here we are. Okay. So I can wear it as a dress, people. I can wear it as a dress. you have a long blazer that covers all your imperfection why not yeah i didn't think i could what using this bag because that's what i used to go thrifting yesterday crossbody so i figured why not why not all right, there's noise in my neighborhood, so I'm going to close my window, and then we can try on the other stuff. All right, guys, so we do have the Kenzie boots on. I actually lifted one of the legs so you can see how it truly looks. And if I was to wear it, I'll probably wear it as such. Got it with the cargo pants. Maybe I'll wear something lighter. Let me find a lighter bag. There's a bag here I have. This is not a bag for me to keep. This is a bag to go to the boutique, but I just thought I should show you guys. Oh, all right. Why did I forget the bags I got? All right, so I'll show you those two. So yeah, here it is with the Kenzie boots. And then, yeah, all this is rust apart from the dress that's from Didi's. So, apart from the, my Chanel belts, Kenzie boots, super cute. All right, let me show you something else that I got from Didi's and I forgot all about it. Hold on, guys. Okay, I forgot this. So, you guys, that's why I said designers copy one another, they really, really do. This bag is by um. Almost look like a Chanel twist lock, doesn't it? It's by um, Gilda Paris. I think you can find this. I think they sell this at HSN or QVC. But this looks like a Bagley Mishka. And so just the retail price for this is uh, $159. I went to Poshmark to see how much people are selling this for. Some people are selling them for 90 so my selling me for 79 so it has the black chain this is the small so you can carry it as a handheld which is what i should have been try trying on with my puffer vest i'm loving this black vest you guys are probably gonna get tired of seeing this vest i'm like okay jackie stop so yeah so we can carry it as such this gilda came they came from ross but i only saw it in one ross and that's the ross by my house i went not ross they came from dds which is california mat stuff came from, some of this came from there this did not come from early showroom because it's a brand so i went to another um dds a little bit further from my 20 minutes away from my house and i couldn't find these bags so here's a smaller one so you would think it should be a crossbody, but it's too short. I think it could be a crossbody for, look at this, I'm struggling, for somebody shorter. So it's more of a shoulder bag or handheld. Or sh more like a shoulder, almost like the, the classic bag. So this is a, a dupe of a, of a Chanel 19. It even actually has a ton lock. This is Gilda Paris, though. This is their logo. It's not the R. You know, we have some people out here who's trying to teach us stuff like we don't know. But um, this right here with the little grommets. If you can afford a Chanel, if you can, you don't want a Bagley Mishka because they look exactly like Bagley Mishkas. They're probably designed at the same place, just 
put the Bagley Mishka logo here. But the only thing about the Bagley Mishka is their chains are longer. So I got that. This was $14.99. I did it. So this the retail price for that was $159. So we got the bigger one. Voila. Another Gilda Paris. It has the 19 quilt quilting. Nice. Shoulder bag. Enough room. We got my shoulder bag. Super cute. If you don't want to do it as a shoulder, you can do just one drop. And then we do have the uh, the other chain that you can just use it as a handheld, which to me is super chic this way. Here we are. Voila. So. I was just running errands. Here we are. Cute. So this one, so just the retail price, make it make sense, was one forty. The small one was one fifty nine. Now at Diddy's, the small one was fourteen ninety nine. Even though so just the retail price was more, but. I guess when they were pricing it, this one was $16.99. So just their retail price, $140. If you go on their site, you will see those. And do you know who else sells this? That I saw, but they use Trader. But they want a, a little bit more like $59, $60. But if you go to Didi's, why not? Here's another bigger one in a blush pink. This actually matches what I'm wearing. Super cute. I'm up and about. I'm not screaming, oh my God, come rub me because I'm carrying this. Mine has the belt. I might not even do the belts. Let's not do the belt. Let's take the belt away. So, voila. You know why? I love this. Now that I took the belt away, I can zip it. You think? You think you can zip it, Jackie? Yes, you can. Just gotta line the zip up. Yes, so, I'm going to with this. There's nothing in there, that's why it falls off. Man, how cute is this, guys? Super cute. Yes. The bag is still the Paris. This to suggest the retail price is one four. Yeah, one forty. Kill the Paris. These are exact look-alike of the Bagley Mishka. The funniest thing is, if even if you Google Gilda Paris, they will show up. Bagley Mishka will show up. But the only thing I say I like about the Bagley Mishka, their chains are longer. They cross body. I have a Bagley Mishka here, so let me just show you my Bagley Mishka and we shall see so we can compare because I was like, huh, who is this company? Hold up. Okay, so this is a Bagley Mishka, okay? The, the concept is the same. And this is a Gilda Paris. Tell me they were not manufactured. Bagley Mishka has one with the same chain that's downstairs in the boutique. But um, this is uh, the one I kept, the Bagley Mishka that I kept for myself. And tell me, the only reason this has little grommets, but they do have some Bagley Mishka in the boutique that has grommets. But this one that I kept doesn't. See right there? These are the jumbo sizes. This is why I like the Bagley Mishka. Crossbody. Super long. That's. That's why I like. You cannot do that with the Gilda Paris. The Gilda Paris is more for shoulder, which is still cute. Not everything gotta be crossbody, okay? You can wear it as such, or you can double the strap. This took from DJ's was $16.99, even though the suggested retail price was a whole lot lesser than the small one. The big ones was priced more. And this has their own chain too, in case. You just want to carry it as a handheld, okay? 
Alright guys, so why not? That's where I go from TVs. Alright, I think I've tried on everything. I think, I think. Oh. One thing I didn't try on is my Charles David boots from Didi's. This ain't gonna take but a minute, so I'm gonna take it with the Kenzie. The Kenzie is so comfortable, guys, that I forgot I had them on. What? Super comfy. Well, Nineteen dollars for Kenzie. Go to go to Macy's. You pay a hundred bucks or one nineteen. Yes. Go to us. Go to Didi's. All right, so that's that. I didn't even care to turn it off, turn it on, you know. Oh, I got this thing in here. This was do this. This was how much again? $16.99 for Charles David. Huh. Oh, I forgot another bag from do this. Okay, I'll show you guys. This is a Ross and do this. Paul, because they're sisters. So, you can open this on both sides. If you want to put it on, you can go this way. Or you can go that way. Okay. Look at here, look at here. Charles David. Alright, so. Huh. Let's see. Alright, alright, alright. I didn't think both zippers were functional, but they are not. Okay, Ooh, I'm hot, even though I'm under the fan. So here we are with the Charles David boots. Mm. Well, I, have a, I have a white bag, so I will carry it with a white bag, because I don't know, maybe a white men's shirt underneath this. Yeah, hold on, let's do that. So yeah, uh, I did put a men's button now, uh, white, and that put the uh, puffer vest in with the Charles David shoes. Okay, look at here. All right, so I can carry my Chanel bucket. I don't wanna do this. I don't want to do this. I can adjust it. It's adjustable. But uh, I can make it a little bit longer. Still a little too big for a crossbody. But you guys get the idea of what I'm doing. I will make it I will make the strap longer, but for now, this is this is what high is gonna look. Okay. Uh, it's all about the Charles David boots for $16.99. We got at a Didi's discount. Oh, I have nothing on. I did not button this because I ain't had the time or energy. Or we can just carry it as a bucket bag. See this? Let me put some shades on. What the? Let me put some shades on. Okay. I know, guys. I am trying to button the shirt up because the buttons are so tiny. This is by Cosini, men's button down Italian shirt. If you look at the fabric, guys, do you see that? So rich. I think cost me like two dollars. All right, I am going to put on this um, Fendi Fendi shades. So this little little things right here says F F F, you know, and the design. In case you're wondering, what is that design? Here we are. So it's a dupe. But it has the FFs, and some of these are in the boutique because I just got them in. 
so they are very steady we have the ff on the side it's not the r and yes i know the difference between an r and a dupe and this is a dupe if a showroom can carry it it means it's a okay there is no name on there nobody um owns the right of letters just like the red bottoms you know, Christian Louboutin thought that he could capitalize on that, but nope, other companies made red bottoms. He started sewing, but never won. So other companies started making red bottoms. Okay, so you can make something and put the letters on there. That don't mean it is what it is. So it is what it is, it's a dupe. All right, so I have that on. That was just my own little literature because some people are wondering the difference. A dupe is to be, it's inspired to look like something without the name on there. The R, the name is on it. And it look exactly, it's a mirror copy of the original. Okay. Simple. We don't need to dissect it. Very simple. All right, guys. So this is it. This is me. Those Charles David boots are too comfortable. Okay. And to each his own. Who are you to judge anybody? Okay? Stop it. We all, we, we can use the money in better places. Okay? So, stop it. If I want to carry a plastic bag, a rubber, a trash bag, that's on me. <laughs> Not for you to judge. Alright, so, here we are. Super cute. The puffer, the cargo pants are from Ross, the Charles David from Didi's, the glasses from Ailey Showroom, and um, the shirt was thrifted from brand new from American Way by the brand called, I just had a brand, what did I do with it? What did I do with it? Oh, here we are. It was a brand new with tag. This is the brand for this button down shirt. Okay, I just took it off. All right, guys, last but not the least, this is a Trina Turk bag. Trina by Trina Turk. A little hobo. Uh, so, just the retail price is $98. And this is Trina. Trina Talk is made for making beautiful dresses. Then they started making accessories. It's like this. It has a snap in the middle. It has a little pouch that you can take off if you want to. And we have a crossbody strap. And this was $12.99 as compared to $98. It's tan and black. It's Trina by Trina Tuck. If you're familiar with Trina, you know you know. Nice contemporary brand. And then we have a crossbody, which I don't think I will use. But these bags are going to the boutique. Like I said, if anybody wants to like this, just holler at your girl. Or you can go to your clothes ladies and see if they have it there. Just double check before you come to me because if you come to me it's not i'm not gonna give you the ladies price because i'm a businesswoman i'm gonna have to make a little change all right guys so yes i am going to close this haul all because uh i'm gonna sit my behind down i am gonna close this haul guys and it was real i gotta go eat I will have brunch and take off my Charles David boots. Okay. Oh, I have the black ones. I have two black ones like this. One I got from Burlington and the other one I think I thrifted from Goodwill. But they're different styles. But look at this. This is Divis. And this was the cheapest. Even the thrifted one that I got from Goodwill. Well, Thing were more than this i think those were like 19. 
but brand new they were brand new too though but this one charles by charles david 16.99 good old ross i mean good old didis didis discount don't sleep on it and i did get some jewelry these earrings too are from didis yeah it was three in a set I came to close the hall but then okay where is that anyway i got this these are from Didi's guys do you all see that and this is the brand don't don't just accessories fanta eyes i love the butterflies love 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 that and then I got the hearts. It has, I forgot to show you guys this. It has like a crystal. Let's see, drop right here. Heavy duty. I think these were like $5. Urban Soul. Didi's, guys. Didi's. And this was $5 too for all those. So, if you have a Didi's next to you, Go to the accessory section and this is the same fanta eyes so i love this chunky one right here and then that for five dollars for the set you guys know i love me some jewelry now this one was mad down this this mad down has a red tag for 4.99 but do you see it super rich then the one that I'm wearing, I don't even know where the piece, what I do with the rest of them. Let me see. Where did it go? Where did it go? Okay. So, yes. This is by Enchanti. Ashanti. Enchante. Okay, here we go. So this two is this is the one that I took out of here, and this is the one that's left. I love this little drop, and this one was six dollars. For some reason, this was more expensive. Don't know why. Maybe because of the stones. Yeah. And when you walk out of there, the alarm went off. I walking out. I'm like, uh, excuse me, Didi's, don't play with me. They left the, they leave the sensors on the jewelry. All I heard was ching, 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 ching. <laughs> I was like, huh? What? <laughs> and they said, Oh, it's your jewelry. I'm like, huh? Okay. <laughs> Turns out. This is what I went shopping with. What was I gonna put in here? <laughs> but they didn't even it's just it's just sad it's just sad because when that make that thing makes noise everybody looks at you i get it is the jewelry deactivate the jewelry people so that when i walk out the door Burlington does the same thing they put those sensors on the jewelry then they don't deactivate it then when you walk out it's like <laughs> and then you be like what <laughs> then they stand back they say oh you're good it's your jewelry I'm like, hmm, now you got all eyes looking at you because the alarm went off at the door. But then they were like, it's your jewelry, you're good to go. I almost want to say, no, I'm not good to go because that was an embarrassment right there. But, you know, they just act like it's nothing. But anyway, let me come to the end of this haul. You guys know I always have to make you, give you a little something to laugh about. Yeah, I mean, I'm cutting my big old bag. I'm walking down here. I said, oh, shh. They don't leave a sensor in one of the stuff. But I watch her take the sensors out of everything. So what is the noise? But then I forgot I bought jewelry in that little bag. And you I just showed you guys the sensor. It is like stamped. <laughs> it's like it's not a good feeling. When you're trying to walk out the door and that thing the lights up like ding ding ding. I'm like, ah. <laughs> but anyway, guys, like and subscribe to my channel love my video share comments this is going to go on my regular channel 
so because i just want to show you guys how you can look fabulous for less when i say less i mean less we're not bring it the bank here but we're still gonna be cute as we want to be we don't have to i mean don't get me wrong i love some high-end okay but most of my high-end uh stuff i got from way back and if i have a few they gifts and the rest you know what but anyway guys so let's not judge one another let's just enjoy one another and inspire one another to go do um I gotta go do my nails. It's like my rug is catching on my aching toes. Yeah. <laughs> oh my God, look at here. It's so grown. Look. Anyway, yes, let's inspire woman empowerment. Okay? Not trying to act like you know more than your next person. Yeah, I get it. Some people don't know, but we can inspire them in a better way instead of trying to teach them. We're not teaching anybody here okay if you're my age you've been dead done that all this is just for fun okay all right so guys i always want to say bye but then i'm still talking 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 all right guys i love you join the sisterhood give me thumbs up hit the notification bell so you know when i upload that's all i got for you today and then later on i'm gonna post on uh a goodwill haul on um i think i'll do that tomorrow on the live channel Pablo's J2 live sale. Okay. Bye guys. Bye.